Uh, let me get him. It's, I'm waiting for it to come up. I don't know why. Whenever you're ready, Chuck. All right. Um, my speech is about why targeting in the NFL, the new rule, should be gotten rid of. Um, the rule is Section 12, Article 9. It was enacted this year, and it was supposed to protect players from concussions, but so far it hasn't done that. <clears throat> in the game of football, you use speed, strength to tackle a player. It's violent. The sport is violent. You have to know that in order to know what's going on here. There's little time to think as a defender how you want to hit a guy, especially when that guy can run a 4 4 40 and a guy my size can't catch him. You have to try to bring him down somehow. And uh, one example of this is Brandon Merriweather. Uh, no sound because the music's kind of dumb. Oh, oh. One that got him suspended. I'll talk about that in a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> this one was a little cheap, but it, if you watch it, if you watch it in, at real time, it doesn't actually look that bad. That one was just hilarious. <laughs> That one also got him suspended last year on a completely different rule. Um, if you watch, you can see him jump straight up into his head right there. Uh, he went out with a concussion for a month. Merriweather didn't care. <laughs> uh, that one wouldn't have broken any rules, but still kind of. And, uh, that was just dumb. That that whole Miami team was known for doing that. Was he on the same team as Sean Taylor? No, I think so. Um, Merriweather, he uses his brute strength for intimidation. If you hit a guy like he hit Marshall earlier, the guy's going to drop the ball nine times out of ten because he knows Merriweather's somewhere and he's probably going to beat him up. <laughs> Merriweather is built for football, so he's going to use his strength and his size. Um, <clears throat> the suspension was because this new rule is you can't launch your head at another opponent's head or neck area. And he was originally suspended for two games and fined more than $150,000, which doesn't seem like a lot when the guy's making a couple million a year, but he has to pay it right there. It's actually a lot of money for him. Um, because of the new rule, players are having to aim lower because they don't want to even risk the chance of hitting a guy in the head. And if you're Dustin Keller, this didn't work out so well because most of the time you have to hit the guy in the knees. Yeah. Watch his right knee. No. There was no suspension for this hit because it is not part of the he, that was in week two of the preseason. He has not played this season. And he probably won't until next July. He ended up with a torn ACL, torn MCL, torn PCL, dislocated and cracked kneecap. All at one time. <laughs> he was too. Um, the rule is supposed to protect players um, especially from concussions, but so far concussions have happened anyway. Like the Dominican Sue this year got fined for a completely legal tackle at be just because the guy had got a concussion. So, kind of iffy. Some other motives to this rule. Uh, one <laughs> is the timing of the rule. The NFL was being sued by the NFL Players Association over concussions from 1980s and 90s, former players were coming back and suing the league because the league didn't know enough about concussions to warn the players. So, $765 million settlement 
I think the NFL was trying to protect themselves from another hit like that. The other one is bad judgment. The rule is kind of inconsistent on what guys get fined and what guys don't. Guys like Merriweather and Adam Kinsu are getting hit all the time with these. But there's one guy from Indianapolis, Pat McAfee, he's a punter. You gotta see this hit. First off, I'll go turn it out. That's a punter. That is a punter. 6'2", 230 pounds of punter. Nothing happened either, did it? No, nope. the closest thing to... <laughs> the closest thing to a suspension that Pat McAfee got out of that rule was Mark Schlereth on ESPN saying that punters still aren't football players. So, kind of cheap. And uh, that, are, that is my source of this thing for listening. Cool.